Hey, what's up, you guys? It's Josie, and um, I have helium. Hey, what is up, you guys? It's Josie, and this isn't my actual voice, if you didn't know. <laughs> eh, eh. Don't worry, I'm not gonna talk like this for a whole video. I just wanted to use one of the balloons I got for Valentine's Day's helium. I have some balloons full of helium, but that's not what this video is. That's not even close to what this video is. Before I get into what this video is, I'm just gonna talk to you about my weekend. So, this past weekend was Valentine's Day weekend. Yeah, I had a softball tournament and my team got fourth place in the tournament out of either 13 or 14 teams. So, not bad, pretty good. I'm proud about that. Um, Valentine's Day, came home and I spent time with my family, spent time with my dog. Um, kind of recovered from the softball tournament. I'm still recovering because I'm like getting sick. You can't really tell but I am really actually getting sick. Then yesterday, I didn't have to go to school because it was a holiday, but it's President's Day, some, something like that, some small holiday that I didn't have to go to school for. So that was great, but at the same time, it wasn't great because I woke up and all my fish were dead. There's not really much I can say about that. So I got a new fish yesterday. His name's Abraham. I was supposed to be getting a fish with him, but um, the fish died when I was in Walmart getting them like I got them and we walk into the checkout and the other fish died so but enough about that randomness like this this intro is a mess okay what what this video is about is annoying things parents do because I know parents think that us kids do a lot of annoying stuff and we do I will admit but I don't think parents understand that they do annoying stuff too so I made a list of some things that came to the top of my mind when I was like yes this annoys me when my parents do this and I'm gonna try to act them out so you, if you don't know what I'm talking about you can figure that out and yeah so that's this video hope you enjoy let's get on to the video the first thing that I find pretty annoying that parents do is that parents like shout your name call you they like want you to go to them at the worst possible moments <sighs> one sheep two sheep three sheep four sheep five sheep six sheep seven sheep eight sheep nine sheep hey Jesse, can you come down here i need you for a minute come on i need your help Coming. <sighs> Finally. Hey, honey, can you come help me with the dishes? The second thing I have on my list is when they tell you a decision is up to you, but ultimately, in the end, they get the last say. Oh, hey, Mom. Uh, I w I've been meaning to ask you. So, you know how I've been talking to... Jimmy and Fred. Well, I decided that I would ask you for who you think I should um, make it official with. Oh, that's up to you, hun. It's up to me? Okay, well, I just wanted to ask you to make sure I got your input because, you know, I, I really like Jimmy. I think, I think I'm going to pick Jimmy. Jimmy, you, you really want Jimmy... I mean, Fred is such a great guy, you know? Last Valentine's Day, he brought you flowers and a lot of candy. And you just had him over the other day. Fred is a very nice guy. He's going to get somewhere real far in life. He's going to be real successful. I just know. I love that Fred, and I love his family. Jimmy, Jimmy's family is a little questionable. I don't know exactly where he's going to go in life. You really want someone who knows exactly where they're going, and you know they're going to be successful. I think I... But if you want Jimmy, but I mean, Fred, you, you have to pick Fred. The third thing that is annoying that parents do is when they yell at you for something you didn't do. And this really goes for like any adult really when like someone of authority is like pinpointing you, targeting you, thinking you did something when it really wasn't you. What are you doing? I cannot believe you left your trash all over the floor. I had to pick it up. I'm tired of picking up all your mess. You are grounded. Oh, uh, that's mine. Number four, using the excuse, I gave birth to you. This one annoys me, especially because it's like, you didn't have to give birth to me. You could have had an abortion. You could have used protection. Like, you didn't have to have me, but you decided 
that you wanted an angel in your life. Hey mom, could you pay me back that $20 you owe me? I want to use it so I can go to the mall with my friends. Excuse me? I don't think I owe you anything. Last time I checked, I gave birth to you. Number five, I know this one bothers everyone because I'm everyone's talked about it and this is kind of just like a general one that everyone knows. When your parents compare you to your friends. <sighs> Here's my report card mom. An F in Spanish. Bertha always gets A's. She gets A's in everything. A's in Spanish. A's in math. And you get F in Spanish. This is unacceptable. Why can't you be like Bertha? Number six. Similar to the last one, but when they compare you to when they were kids, that 30 years difference is a big difference. Or however far away your parents' age gap is, it's a big difference. When you were my age, you guys didn't even have phones. Phones weren't a thing. When you were my age, CD players weren't a thing. When you were my age, the internet was... Like, things have advanced so much that you can't compare to what you did when you were a kid to what I did when I was a kid and what you thought when you were a kid and what I thought when I was a kid. And, like, you can't compare it because they're so drastically different because times have changed so drastically. Man, I really need a new phone. Oh, you want a new phone? Well, when I was your age, I wanted new books. I always wanted new books. And I and I didn't even get a phone until I was 20. And the seventh and last thing that I find annoying about my parents is when they are loud when you are asleep. I don't get it. Why do you have to be loud when I'm asleep? When you're asleep and I'm up, I'm like as quiet as a mouse. <laughs> anything annoying that parents do you can comment down below that's it for this week's video i hope you enjoyed it and give this video a thumbs up if you did i hope you guys have a good rest of the week a good rest of the day and i will see you next week with another video <laughs> give this video a thumbs up if you want me to do a whole video with helium like doing something with it because i have a huge balloon over there that i can use Okay, bye, Shalissa. Bye. I'll see you next week with another video. Eh, eh, eh.